Welcome to the chapter Smart Tables. This slide presents the overview of the chapter. Learning Objectives By the end of this chapter, you will be able to Explain about the tally marks Identify the counting of numbers by using tally marks Solve the problems in image-based tally marks Introduction to the Smart Tables See the table shown on the screen. Can you tell how many 1, 2 and 3 numbers are there in the table? For this, what method would you follow? Let us find answers for these types of questions in this chapter. Let us see how to count the things using tally marks. Here some children are randomly picking some balls from the bowl. The above table represents how many times each ball has been taken out from the bowl by the children. Taking out the ball each time is represented by a single line. It might be difficult for us to count each of the lines if the number of times of taking out the ball is increasing. Here if we see, counting 8 might look easy but counting 24 is not so easy. Hence, to overcome this problem, we group the five lines as a set which could make our counting easier. Let us make five lines as a set. The first four lines have to be drawn as vertical lines and the fifth line should be drawn diagonally across the previous four lines. Now, we know that each set represents the number 5 and the remaining can be counted easily. This way of counting the numbers is called tally marks. The table represents the tally marks written by the boy. Count the numbers and type them in the appropriate boxes. Take up an activity to tally marks. Observe the table and answer the following questions. Let us have a look on some example problems. The following pictograph shows the number of students class-wise in five different classes. Here scale one image represents the five students. Which class has minimum and maximum number of students? How many more students does class 2 have as compared to class 5? What is the total number of students in all the five classes? The solution is as follows. Class 1 and 2 have the maximum number of students 35 students each. Similarly, class 5 has the minimum number of students, that is 20 students. Class 2 has 15 students more than class 5. There are 145 students in all the 5 classes. Let us see some exercise problems. Let us do an activity on image-based tally marks. Look at the following table and answer the given questions.
let us have a look on some example problems Summary Let us recap the highlights of this chapter. We have learned what are tally marks and how to use them to count the numbers. We have seen a few real time examples where we can apply these methods to know the count of the things or materials. We have also solved the problems in image based tally marks. Practice Joan Try to solve the questions on your own. Click Solution tab to verify your answer. Follow-up work. The following chart shows the sales of balls during a week. Write any three conclusions from the above chart. Test your understanding of the chapter by taking the mock unit test. You have successfully completed the chapter Smart Tables.